Hello everyone and welcome to Fish Island. Now, if you don't mind, let's play Lucius. Uh, doing episode 3 today. I started recording a little earlier, but um, something happened with my computer so I have to redo it. I didn't get very far though, so we're going to go ahead and do this now. Um, <clears throat> I wanted to remind you guys I'm doing a live stream this Friday on the uh, 14th. I don't know what time yet, but I will keep you updated. Uh, that is when Lucius 3 comes out, so that's what I'll be playing during my live stream. So, here we go. We're starting from chapter 7, because that's where I was last time. <clears throat> um, yes, let's, let's go and uh, find out what we're doing. In the blink of an eye, memories are born. Okay. Go through here. There she is. Because remember, we're framing Jovita. <clears throat> uh, at the end of the last episode, Have you seen we learned that that's what we were going to do. Okay. Now we'll go downstairs. Wait, do I have anything for her? Something going on between her and Uncle Tom. And there's Uncle Tom. I saw Uncle Tom with Susan. If I could just somehow show this to Jovita, I think Grandfather might have a camera up in his study. Okay. <clears throat> so now we have to find the study. Uh, which honestly took me like 20, maybe 25 minutes when I tried to do this earlier. But now I know exactly where it is. So it's going to be a little quicker. Okay. So remember when I said now I know exactly where it is? I lied. I know kind of where it is. Are you all right, Here it is. Hello there, boy. Everything seems to be going well. And I get this cool map that goes to a secret door in the wine cellar. And I got these photo cards. Oof. And now I can pick up the camera. Oh, and I have to... Oh. I didn't know I could just move through like that. Okay. And then we go back over. Are you alright, son? Down to Uncle Tom, who's on that side, I think. See, I still don't remember very well where everything is. Yeah, it's on this side. <clears throat> and I got the picture. Oh. And I can put the picture here. Okay, Jovita. I should hide the photo in Jovita's room and plant some evidence to blame her for some of the other deaths. So to plant the evidence, um, yeah, I want that. I can put that in there. Um, what else can I... Nope. It's this one. Oh. Okay, yeah. Put it in, close the door. And seen your uncle yet? Now we watch her. Oh my god. How can he do this to me? Oh no. <clears throat> Why? Oh now my. what do we do? She has seen the pictures and went crying to the balcony. She's now in a very delicate state. I should use that to my advantage. Why? Oh, okay. Why? Use it to my advantage. Where are you going? All right, the balcony. We just heard that. Okay. And now, 
that I'm on the balcony, I can mind control her. What? Uh, come on. Mind control. Wow, this is not working. Okay, there it is. <clears throat> you gotta click on the rail, but it's a little sketchy sometimes. Oh. And what's she doing? A swan dive? While little Lucius just watches on passively. Ooh. That was brutal. Just mind controlled her to jump right off the uh, balcony. Oh, Dr. Kerborkian. Okay. Yes, more Antichrist stuff. <clears throat> it seems we've found an obvious culprit in Miss Javita Munez. The missing padlock from the cooler, the rat poison. It almost seems too convenient. Why are you telling me this? It's not like we were close or anything. Well, we have a motive, too. Pictures of you and Susan Myers, and how should we put it delicately, flagrante delicto. It seems your involvements with the staff are a little too tangled. What? I knew nothing about this. You mean she did all this because I had a fling with Susan? Oh my god! What have I done? Tom hasn't done anything. His indiscretions <clears throat> may have led to this, but he would never have put them up to it. There's no reason for it. <sighs> Look, this whole thing is a freaking mess, and I'm trying to put a cap on it. So both of you listen good. Javita was stealing from the house. She poisoned Agnes because she was onto her. We'll ignore all the, uh indiscretions in the report for the sake of your family whatever it takes detective we want to put this all behind us i'll straighten tom out but i don't think i'll be able to save my campaign at this point the press will have a field day well there's nothing i can do about that mr wagner but they won't get a story from me i'm just trying to make a living we'd finally managed to close the case sir so i thought Seems like she had been behind every death so far in the house, except the butler. It kept bothering me. Could that really be an accident? Every path we took on the case left me uneasy. Then, right on time, a month later, it happened again. It looked like another suicide. It another might have been suicide. me who pushed him over the edge. <clears throat> and for that, I am ashamed. Okay. <clears throat> So he's thinking he pushed him over the edge, so I'm reckoning, I guess it's, uh, what's his name? Uncle Tom. The mind can take only so much. I'm gonna kill Uncle Tom and make it look like a suicide. Mm. What? what? Today I'm staying close to hell, in the chambers I like to dwell. <clears throat> okay, so now we go Leave find your father alone. He's Uncle very Tom. Upset. I mean, he has a lot to deal with right now. He has a lot to deal with right now. Um, yeah, I'm the one he has to uh, deal with. Okay, now where is Uncle Tom? Oh, wait. I remember where he is. Yeah, I made it through the door. <clears throat> Last time, I also looked around a really long time for Uncle Tom. But, I remember now that he's up here. This is his room. Uncle Tom! Okay. Um, he's been drinking for a month now. Seems like he actually had feelings towards Dravita. That reminds me, when I picked up the camera, I saw a map on the table. So, the map... 
secret door wine cellar. <clears throat> okay. So actually, last time while I was looking for, um, while I was trying to frame Jovita, I was trying to find Uncle Tom's room, and I sort of stumbled onto the cellar, which was a cool coincidence, because otherwise I would have had to look for it, which would have taken forever. You know, time passes a Hello, lot darling. faster with music. Uh, we're just going straight there. You got the wine cellar here, and you gotta go behind that curtain. Yeah. We got this cool room here. I found the chamber. There must be something useful here. You got some sick candles, some upside down crosses, and this, which I thought was a candle last time, and I looked around for ages. Turns out, um, <clears throat> some sort of deadly poison bottle. So, now that I know what's going on, this bit is going a lot quicker. Now we just have to get back oh, to Uncle Tom and make him kill himself, I guess. <clears throat> or make it look like he killed himself. Because we don't want people to think that I killed him. I think I need to lie down for a while. Then go lie down, woman. Ugh. I can put it in the wine. It wasn't letting me do that last time. Oh, that's because I didn't have it in my hand. Okay, but he's sitting right there. Um, so what they really want you to do is come in here. Um, uh, come on. Pick up the whiskey and combine them. I have added some poison I found from the chamber to Tom's whiskey bottle. Oh, and then I come over here. Why? I don't understand. And why did she do it? What? Why am I okay, there it is. Now while he's looking away, I put it down there. <clears throat> I placed a poison bottle near Tom. He didn't notice anything. Yet. It's you. You did this. You little shit. You did it all. You. Totally brutal. Poisoned him, and then stood there while he died, watching him die. That's no good. Oh, yeah. Tom? It's me, Charles. Please open the door. Ain't nobody in there alive. And oh no! Oh shit! No, not this! No, not this! No, not this! No, not this! No. Mr. Wagner, I'm at a loss for words. You came to your own conclusions, Detective. Our family is suffering a great shame now. I have little hope after this. 
I want you and your men out of this house by nightfall. There's nothing more for you here. We'll take care of our own problems from now on. Again, I'm really sorry for your loss. I'll say a prayer for you and your family, Mr. Wagner. Say a prayer for them. Cool. That'll help them a lot. Forgive me, Father, for I have <clears throat> sinned. Oh, he's actually gone to it a has church. Been, oh, I don't know. A long time since my last confession. There's a family. Their home is befallen by calamities. I can't explain. I've been trying to help, but I may have involved myself too far. I, I've been having nightmares. Terrible scenes playing through my head. And this family, they are the players. It sounds to me like this family needs help, my son. From it sounds priest. to me like the church should intervene. I get to kill a priest. Oh, now we're in the uh, bedroom again with Lucifer come to visit. And now we get to see what happens. You are doing well. Thank you. But I do tire of these menial offerings. Maids, butlers, accountants, drunks. Don't you think it's time to up the stakes? Maybe make this a little more personal. So kill my family. Some sneaky snakes in your fold, Lucius. You need to weed them out of the grass. Let me show you something else you can do. Help on your Ooh, you more magic. To make people forget things. To make this people forget things. Yes, I bet. When you are caught, this will happen. You will have a limited time to act. Oh, four. Um. What skill and promise okay, they will forget everything, and you may continue your work. The more power can be derived from the sacrifice. Ooh. Look closer to your foe, Lucius. Do me proud. Okay. I will, Daddy. Okay. Now we get to move on to the grass is always red on this side. Uh, I'm going to murder someone. And it's going to be bloody. And outside, grass. Um, when I win, it's not paper that you bring. When you lose, it's scissors that you choose. Rock. Okay. <clears throat> yep. Let's go, 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 go. Lucius, go, go. can I ask you a question? Oh, never mind. I'm just being. Uh, I'm six. I like any questions that you would want to know the answers to. Uh, I don't know the answers to. <clears throat> yes outside so do I get to like drop a rock on his head or something Antonio is cutting the grass again I could probably somehow break his mower I wonder why he always looks like he just came from a disco Trying to get out of the way of him. Oh no, someone can see me. Spotted. Okay. Got to. Oof. Five out of six. Okay, so that's not how I do it. 
Um, what's oh, that's just a puddle. Um, so, uh, there's a tree. I'm stuck in a tree. Oh, cool. And uh, come on. Ah, uh, no, no. Oh, I still. I didn't drop the rock. Ah. Okay. Now I put the rock down. Then I can go <clears throat> play by the shed, I guess, until something happens. <coughs> Son of a where did this rock come from? I bet I can fix this. He seems to be trying to get that mower working again. This might be my chance. Okay. Yeah. Uh, nothing happened. What's going on? It wasn't enough. He managed to get away from the blade. Okay. Oof. Well, now what? Well, I can't do anything else. What, did I just fail? What? What am I meant to do? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so I just mind controlled him to kill himself with the mower. Oh! Damn! Oh, crap! He shoved his head in there. Ah. Uh. That's so brutal. Yes. Well, I tried. I went to... weeks without a proper night's sleep. I just couldn't wrap my head around everything, as if something was evading me. I resorted to the church for help. My hope was that they could visit the house and maybe help some of the people there, offer counsel, whatever it is priests do. I was wrong. Predictably, there was another accident. This time in the garden. One of the most bizarre things I had ever seen. I had no solid explanations, and the press were hounding the department for information. Those vultures were constantly circling the mansion. Everything in my world was falling apart. I was interviewing Charles Wagner on a daily basis now. He tried to tell me this was in a totally different realm. His father, Fabius, who I thought was a little batty, had gone missing by this stage. Everyone presumed he just took off to escape the stress. Okay. The grass can grow again. <laughs> What's really going on, Dad? Have we been cursed? Do we have enemies? Are we being extorted? Or is this some sort of vendetta? Don't talk such rubbish, Charles. You're grabbing at straws. I know enough about your past mob ties. I know how we got our money. You don't know shit. And don't ask. Just be thankful for what I've given you. Have you no feelings, Dad? Why didn't you come to Tom's funeral? He was a wastrel, and he died a wastrel's death. He was no son of mine. That's cold by any stretch. You're a heartless, bitter old man. Who's given you everything you could have ever possibly wanted, and now it's time for payback. 
There are events afoot which are far beyond anything you would understand. I'm gonna lose this election. My world is falling apart. Lucius won't speak. Nancy is losing her mind, and you're crazy too! We're all just pawns in the larger scheme of things. These people, they're just fodder for death's eventual scythe. You only need to play your role, Charles, and be a good boy. There are rewards for those who endure to the end. Okay. <clears throat> Oof. Even more cutscenes, I remember this time. Good afternoon, miss. I'm Father Lagel of the Winter Hill Diocese, and this is Father de Cosima. We've heard of the unfortunate tribulations that have befallen this house, and we've come to offer a blessing for better days for this place. Would the master or mistress Who be home? that? What? Get the hell out of my house, bloody parasites! Take your skirts back to the poor mix in town. They'll swallow your Jesus crap. But get off my lawn, or I'll give you a reason to pray for your Easter bunnies. Damn. Peddling their tripe here on my property. Make sure they're let out those gates. Okay. Even more. Oof. I guess that's the detective? Or no. Okay. Someone's sneaking around the house. <clears throat> okay. Oof. That's some old wine. Who are you? What are you doing here? Ah, ah, you surprised me. I'm Wayne Preston from the Herald. I'd like a word with you about uh -huh. recent events here at Dante Manor. I'm willing to pay handsomely for information. Don't you know who I am? Oh, Mr. Wagner, I'm so sorry. I tried the doorbell, but there was no answer. It looked like it would rain, so I simply- You're trespassing. I could have you shot. Hey, wait now! Oh. Smashed a wine bottle over his face. Ooh. Do I have another Lucifer? Yeah. Ah, Lucius. What wonderfully gruesome offerings you have given to me. Now yep. we must Come on. The march. We must continue with no looking back. There are, are you going to give me something else? Lucius. They suspect. You must be on your guard. Okay. But now it is time to teach you the greater skills. Yes. So that you can protect yourself. If the need arises. More skills. I don't know what I'm gonna get, but do you like to light fires? Yes. 
Your daddy tells you not to play with matches, but mm -hmm. I can show you a better way. Yes. Select combustion skill by pressing 5. Now start building power by pressing and holding mouse 1. When you let go, you will whirl a fireball towards your target. Yes. <clears throat> Light Lucifer on fire. That's pretty cool. Try to kill this dummy. Notice that he has a health bar. Burning alive. Now listen to me, Lucius. This skill can only be used sometimes, and in the most extreme situations. Each time you make a sacrifice for me, you can attain this skill, but only for a short time, until the power dissipates. Okay. Devil's trainee. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay. Betrayal. Hmm. Come on, my boy. It's time we talked. So, you've been exploring, and you've found the chamber. Well done, Lucius. Thank you, Grandpa. Get your clothes on and meet me down there. Don't let anyone see you on the way. I notice that not everyone is sleeping yet. Okay. Also, Fabius, my grandfather woke me up. He told me to meet him in the chamber. Seems that everyone's still awake. I need to find a way to get past everyone undetected. Darkness is my friend. All the king's men could not get Humpty Dumpty together. In those days, they did not have a clue. Okay. Can't go through there. Or there. Oh. oh, is this where I can do the thing? And something happening? Yes. Something happened. Oh, I knocked out all the lights. I guess. Oh. Power outage. I can't even... Oh, right. That's why I can't use the doors. Because I'm not using the right thing. Okay. Nope. Let's go that way. Or that way. Okay. I guess I'll go the only other way available to me. And I can't see much at all. But this one goes downstairs. There's people over there. So, um. Wait, where am I going? No, no, run, 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 back this way. No, no. Oh, I got spotted.
Ah, oh, she saw me again. Go, quick, quick. Don't get spotted again. Okay. Okay, I think I'm good. Okay, now I have my own torch. Okay, and I'll turn it off just in case I wasn't meant to use it. So, you've been led here. You found the chamber. Well done, Lucius. My two dumbass kids played down in these cellars for years and never suspected a thing. I had this chamber built with a mansion, you know, back in the day. This is where it all happens, Lucius. This is the heart of Dante Manor. All sorts of things have happened here. I have entertained guests of the highest stature. Now is the time for you to discover your destiny. You have a calling, Lucius. I have been expecting you for much longer than you can imagine. My sons have been a disappointment to me. But it is you I have been waiting for. You will show us all the way. But you've been reckless in your learning, Lucius. Jeopardized everything. You've brought too much attention on us. And now we have to deal with it. You can't risk discovery. Don't worry. After we dispose of him the right way, you will become much stronger. This is a holy place where the blood will work for us. Well, mainly for you. That's you, isn't it, my boy? Why don't you talk? Are you the prophecy? The master said he'll take his due from my bloodline. I'm sure you are what he meant. Get this table ready for the ritual while I find the correct scripture. Okay, so many cutscenes this episode. Like, feels like that's most of what's happening. I kind of just want to skip them, but I feel like I'll miss um, some useful information. Um, oop, oop. Shackles used for strapping victims to the table. No. No inventory item. Strap. Item has been used correctly. Okay, cool. And do I need to get his other arm too? Or... Oof. Nope. Is that all I need to do right now? Okay. Um. <clears throat> okay, so there's more stuff I need to do. I guess. Oh. I just do this. Oh, there's a bowl there. And... This one can go here. Okay. One of the cups... Oh. My grandfather told me that he was behind the pact with Lucifer, my real father. He wants me to help... He wants me to set up the sacrificial table. He blamed me for this reporter. Better get this table ready. One of the cups is broken. It will not hold blood. I need to fix it. Did I leave my glue inside the desk? 
in the East Wing classroom. Okay, so... <clears throat> um, <clears throat> Come on. Ah, yes. Back up this way. <clears throat> uh, do I need to keep sneaking? Oh, wait, I'm still in the cellar, so. Okay. So I do still need to sneak. Wait. East Wing, I think, is on this side. room. Okay, this is the library. It's not really where I want to be. Okay. Let's go up this way, I guess. goes to the okay no I get it I know how to get where I'm going I think Oof. here. Oh. Okay, come on. Ah. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Whatever. I'm just going to keep going. Um. How do I get to the classroom? need to go this way. I think I'm doing fine. Wait, no, that's not it. It's across this side. Get to the classroom. Scene. <clears throat> Glue. Okay. Now I just need to get back.
Oh, game over. Okay. Oh, there's so many. I'm just skipping through all these cutscenes because we've already done them. Oh. No. What are you doing up there? Go back to your bed right now. Okay. Holy crap, I can't believe that let me get away with that. There was totally a guy that I mowed past. And back in here. Oh, come on. Hey, Lucius, don't worry. It's just a shortage. Let's get you to bed. Come on. The inventory item. Ah, quick, 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 quick. quick. Okay, that's fine. Hey, Lucius, don't worry. It's just a shortage. Let's get you to bed. Don't really need the light anymore. Oh, right. Um. Okay. Put this down somewhere. There. Uh, there's nothing yet. Hello, my boy. Yep. Okay. So. I fixed the... Do I need to put certain balls in certain places? Okay. Um, have I done all of the balls? I've done all the balls. Um, unlit candles. Cool, 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 okay, cool, 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 now, let's see here, he thinks that the pact makes me his friend, that is certainly not the case, oh, so, the journalist isn't my... Oh, it... Lucifer... Ooh! I can... Oh, there's a dagger. Ha ha ha! Lucifer wanted me to kill... Better people. So that's what I'm doing. Killing my grandpa. Gramp, gramp. Oof. Right in the back. Backstabbing little cockbite. Oh, and he's bleeding down into the bowl. Nice, 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 nice. Nine of them did not matter. I think that's because I killed ten people, nine of whom didn't matter. Oh, my head. What is this place? What the hell? Just let me go. Okay, little boy. Okay now. 
Well, let's just calm down and try and figure out what happened here. Oh. Fires. Holy shit! How the okay. hell did you do that? So I have to Cross. That's kill him affecting. with fire. This will keep you at bay. Oh no! Into the fiery furnace. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, what are you doing? Stop messing with my crosses. Ah! Uh. Oh, did you kill me? What? I had better restart right goddamn there. Okay, yes. Uh. Oof. What's happening? Uh, come on. Turn the crosses. That's what I'm doing, right? Bobby has caught him sneaking around the mansion and strapped him to the sacrificial table. I am on the other hand. I, on the other hand, stabbed Fabius. I can feel something running through my veins. The flames of hell are running through me. Wayne is turning the crosses so that I'll grow weaker. I'll show him. Ah! And he totes tries to stab me. Oh, uh, come on. Go back, turn this cross. Yep, cool, cool, cool. Ah. Okay, come on. Okay, come over here. Shoot him with another fireball. Come over here. Shoot him with another fireball. Yes. Okay. Burned him alive. Yep. Okay. Are we gonna... Okay. Fire Master. Excellent. Book of Leviathan, Anton LaVey, invocations to Satan? <laughs> Prepare war, wake up the mighty men, let all the men of war draw near, let them come up. Jesus, Dad, what were you getting into? Was not Jesus. Nancy, I think Lucius might be Oof. cursed. It's the only explanation I can find. Dad has been missing for weeks, <coughs> and it seems he was into some really crazy occult stuff. Excuse me. I can't rule out the possibility that my father had something to do with this. But we need to get Lucius to a psychologist to find out. He can't tell us anything himself. Oh my god, Charles! Have we not been through enough already? <laughs> So yeah, the dialogue and the 
voice acting, not so great, but I am liking a lot of the uh, rest of the story. Um, I don't so much like that we have to do everything a certain way. Um, we don't get to be creative with how we kill people and what order we do it in and, you know, all of that. Um, but overall, I am enjoying the game. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, share, and above all, subscribe for more indie horror Let's Plays and sometimes Suicide by a Swan Dive right here on Fish Island. Bye!